been real. I'm off to Winnipeg. Alex is off to... Where are you headed, bud? Springfield, Illinois. Oh yeah, that's right. Little meetup. Moral of the story is we did some Guggen stuff this week. Spencer helps out with the Guggen stuff. We got done. We flew from Winnipeg to back to Dallas. Now, he is going to drive to Winnipeg. Actually, fish for a few days? I'm going to fish for one day, yeah. Will you record something if you catch something sure. on your phone? Yeah. Okay, we'll include that. <laughs> Moral of the story is he's going to drive the truck back to Minneapolis. We're going to meet back up with him there. And uh, Soby and I are headed to Springfield, Illinois. Lots of editing to do by Soby, so he needs a coffee. I'm uh, gonna be catching up on some Z's. If they have Wi-Fi on the flight, though, I will be looking for dope beats. Um, that is my job title lately, is find dope beats. I found two dope beats um, in like a week, so I'm definitely on my game. But uh, honestly, I'm thinking about getting an egg white wrap right now from Starbucks. Um, Watching my figure lately, got to look looking for the meetup tomorrow, <laughs> so uh, we'll go with the egg, egg white wrap. Delicious. Mud. The most processed airport wrap possible, brought to you by Starbucks. Get it. They're going like hotcakes. Honestly, it's not up to Mr. Buddy standards, but... You gotta do what you gotta do in the airport. The Mr. Buddy's not safe in the airport, so they unfortunately couldn't bring it in. So we're gonna have to uh, roll with the uh, conventional oven that they cooked this in. Luckily tomorrow I might be reunited with my Mr. Buddy and I can maybe cook some snacks for you guys, but till then, we'll get on this flight. Twelve twenty-five a.m. We have 12 hours to get to the meetup, and we are currently in Chicago, Illinois. And the wrap is still processed and still in my stomach. That's all I have for you. Springfield bound. Are you ready? Woo! Just like it. Winston just got off a plane from, where were you? I've been with you, and then I went to Texas, and then I went to Florida, and then I caught a shark and killed a pig, and all my clothes are dirty, and you remember? I was wearing this shirt last time you saw me, like a week ago. Like I'm a week like, ago, when we were doing Guggen squad stuff. So, I'm we borderline are, skank. We are at Shields in Springfield, and we are gonna see uh, how many people show up. It looks like it's pretty busy. Winston wants to ride a Ferris wheel, we'll do that after. We'll bring you down and get you on. Over in Illinois. Gerard North Mac. Gerard, all the elders. Oh, Gerard North Mac. Bloomington, Illinois. Bloomington, Illinois. Decatur, Illinois. Where are you guys from? Bloomington, Illinois. Very cool. Where are you guys from? Springfield. Springfield, very cool. Where are you from? I'm from Vandalia. Vandalia. 618. Where are you guys from? Abingdon, Illinois. Abingdon, Illinois. Very cool. Where are you guys from? Springfield. Where are you from? Illinois. Where are you guys from? Jacksonville, Illinois. Very cool. Where are you from? Pawnee. Leroy, Illinois. Yes, exactly. <laughs> it's pretty entertaining. Yeah, I gotta admit, it's, it is pretty damn entertaining. What's Hello. your favorite video? How about that? Uh, your lettuce video. Lettuce. Thank you so much for coming. Hey, I'd like to shout out my friend Evan and my other friend Gage that couldn't be here today. So, good luck, guys. Good luck, guys. Where are you from? Cooper. Cooper. I'm from Sherman. Sherman. Do you do a lot of fish in Sherman? Well, it depends on what pond we go to. Oh, yeah? What's your favorite lure? Uh, I don't have 
And I, I just... You like every lure? Yeah. You just like to catch fish? Yeah. yeah. You like bluegill or catfish or bass? Oh. Oh. Actually... You're my kind of man. <laughs> I got this. My, my little bluegill. That's his bluegill. Yeah. That's a big bluegill. Yeah. It might be a state record. It's got big old eyes, doesn't it? Yep, that's because that's because they that's because my guy that's because the guys made it that way. Oh, he made it that way? Yep, yeah. some guys just made it for me and I didn't want them to like get the X I so they did this. Yeah. You gotta figure it out. That's yeah. really cool, isn't it? Yep. You think you can make one? I can't get some I can't make one. No. I, yeah, I can only make like a... Uh, like, 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 like boats made out of tape. Boats made out of tape? Yeah, yeah, I can just make, I just, I'll just do the balloons and I'll just put tape yeah. for it and I'll just put tape like here. <laughs> That's awesome. That's yeah. more than I can do. I can't even build a birdhouse. Awesome. Yeah, same as me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, Parrick always has snacks. He's ice fishing, has chips or whatever. Yeah, so also that one, I'll crack it up. <laughs> for like, Hook him up with some snacks. That's, that's so yeah, were you in on this too? Uh huh. Dog? Yeah, a little bit. We have like big crates up. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Meetup's complete. We're headed out, grab some food, and get back to Chicago. All right, I'm back. Hey guys, thank you guys so much for watching this far into the meetup. Hopefully, you guys have enjoyed the video so far. I kind of want to talk to you guys. I haven't sat down in a while and talked. Um, I feel like some of you guys have missed me. Like just talking to the camera because I used to like talk every day but the difference is now I'm just I'm focused on fishing which I love way more than anything you know back in the day it's crazy I watched some of my old high school videos last night and it was just like wow or not even my high school videos my freshman year of college videos just like wow what were, what were you thinking Alex but it also shows just like how real it is with the story all you can watch a video back from 2012 all the way till 2018 now it should be like you could literally watch my fishing grow, my channel grow, and just the difference in quality has been, wow, no, I'm not crying. Just the difference in the quality of the videos, especially since Sam's got here, and it's just been, it's honestly been refreshing to be able to just focus on fishing. The last trip to Manitoba was absolutely insane for big fish and just for learning. You know, I was thinking about this uh, back like when I was 18 or 17, like me, Sam and John, Sam Dice, um, we used to like, go on trips Wisconsin northern Wisconsin but I never really explored the north until I started making YouTube videos the first trip to Minnesota was the never stop tour and then went up into Canada you know it's just like that's where the untouched bodies of water are and it's crazy that YouTube has allowed me to do this as well as you guys so we're almost at 400,000 um, we're gonna be doing I'm gonna be doing a giveaway shortly for 400,000 so we're like 15,000 away so probably next month we will hit that hopefully as well as, I need to get in touch with Outdoor Angler. Um, he's, he won a 300,000 subscriber giveaway, and I haven't got a DM from you. So if you could DM me, that would be great. Um, just please DM me again, because it might have got lost in my DMs. But before we end this video, um, I just want to give a quick shout out to the Guggen Squad. I don't know if that makes any sense, because I'm a part of the Guggen Squad. But we gave away a boat. If you haven't watched that video, the video will be in the description below. It's all about this t-shirt club. I will also leave the t-shirt club below. It is a way to join, to wear some of our apparel, and be part of a huge giveaway. We are giving away two boats next year. So, and look at that design. I love it. So, on that whole note, hopefully you guys enjoyed the Manitoba tour, the North tour, and ice fishing. Is ice fishing over? In Chicago, yes. I'm in Chicago right now. I just got back from the Shields meetup. I'm actually going back up north to pick my truck up, and supposedly... There's a huge snowstorm, and we might not make it there, but tomorrow's video should be enjoyable for you guys, or the video that comes up next, because we do have to do a little bit of traveling to make it to where our truck is. So, on all of that note, make sure to comment below what you guys want for me to give away for F400,000, as well as what you guys want to see um, after this kind of northern swing is done. We're picking the truck up, and we're going to head back down to Chicago. We're going to dump the snowmobiles off, put those away for summer storage, and uh, got a couple big announcements coming up. We got a huge trip in March, as well as a huge trip at the end of April, and then possibly a new boat, maybe. I'm thinking about getting a new boat. So that's kind of what's going on. I know everybody's getting new boats, but I feel like it's time to upgrade from the Illumicraft tender boat I'm in. So thank you guys so much, and we will catch you guys next time.
on another episode of AP Basketball. Uh.